Welcome to Mars! If this is your first time here, you may be wondering what to expect, where the hottest nightclubs are, and what can kill you. So here's a list of reasons you will definitely die on Mars. Number 1. All the water in your body will boil away. The Martian atmosphere has only 1% as many molecules as Earth's atmosphere, which puts it well below a pressure point called the Armstrong limit. That's the point when all the water in your body starts to boil at normal human temperature. Your saliva, tears, urine, the liquid in your lungs will evaporate within minutes, and you really need those to survive. You can actually observe this effect on Earth if you go camping at high altitudes and try to boil water. It'll start boiling before the temperature reaches 100 degrees Celsius, which it does at sea level. But once you reach the Armstrong limit, it'll boil at 37 degrees Celsius, which is human body temperature. And that's super bad for staying alive! <laughs> The pressure is also too low for your cells to even utilize oxygen, if there were enough oxygen on Mars, which of course there isn't. Number 2. Important molecules break down immediately and you might get cancer. Remember how Mars's atmosphere is only 1% as dense as the Earth's? Well, that atmosphere is also protecting us from harmful radiation from the sun. Even on Earth we have problems with harmful UV rays from the sun, which can cause cancer. On Mars, you're gonna need SPF 10,000, and we haven't even invented that yet. And it's not just bad for your skin. UV light is so damaging, it creates molecular instability in the bonds between atoms. Ammonia, for example, which is an essential element for many biological organisms, breaks down within a few hours on Mars. So don't expect to see any carrots or cows up here. Number 3. The soil is poison! Hungry after the 7 month long trip to Mars? Well I hope you packed a sack lunch, because there's nothing to eat up here and we certainly can't grow anything. The problem is that Martian soil is extremely toxic to humans, as multiple orbiters and rovers have confirmed that the soil is rich with compounds called perchlorates, which contain chlorine. Not only do these compounds make it extremely difficult for plants to produce chlorophyll, which they need to grow and which limits their ability to produce oxygen, the compound also accumulates in plant leaves so we can't eat them anyway because perchlorates damage all kinds of life. Whoops! Number 4. Brr! It's freezing! On most days, it's a breezy minus 81 Fahrenheit, but on particularly chilly days, it can hit a cool minus 110. Either will kill you from hypothermia within 10 minutes. Better bring a few hundred coats. Number 5. Horrific Global Dust Storms So imagine that you're living in your nice Martian house, tending to your toxic soil garden and hoping that the molecules in your body don't rip apart, and all of a sudden the dust storm warning on your phone goes off. <sighs> Ugh. Shut up already! Well, hurry up and get inside, because within less than an hour you're about to be in the middle of a storm throwing sand and lightning at 60 miles per hour. Oh, and the storm actually covers the entire planet. And it lasts the entire month. And it can drop the global temperature by 40 degrees Celsius. And it also sucks up all the available water. There's also the low gravity, no magnetic field, not a lot of light, and super fine dust that can cause lung disease if you breathe it. Anyway, welcome to Mars! 